<laughs> why, not, why, don't, why don't we harness our blowing up things and do some shadow run? <laughs> Scooter, will you play with us? Yeah, absolutely. Scooter, would Scooter, you know, you... Is, is he going to be Mercy or the Doctor? What would you, would you like to be? Yeah, well, you, Do- oh, yeah, your choice, Scooter. Uh, the Doctor is uh, Curtis. spelled with a K. Yeah, yeah. Okay. No, no, no. Uh, yeah, I'll do the Doctor. I was trying to just run through the, the what they've done in the past. I'll do the Doctor. All right. So do do we do we do we be cis normative and bring up a girl to play Mercy, or do we? Uh, 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 we haven't had any women up here, so like, right? <laughs> Adam, yes. Adam, no, you had your you had your moment, Adam. <laughs> Uh, wait, Could wait. fucking Dave Klein up here and just fucking do this? Wait, really? No, <laughs> no, no, no. Dave Klein had his spotlight. I saw, I saw a timid hand here. Uh, and, and oh, you're Jen. You're up before. Well, okay. Let's 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 get some new blood. Uh, right here. What's your name? Equally timid hand. I'm Alisa. Alisa. Oh, like the name would. Like, that's the audition. <laughs> right, do, do you want to come up? Yeah. Okay. Right. Right. Alisa, everybody, welcome here to the stage. I guess if you said, I am Hitler, <laughs> that would be a name that would be like, eh, Hitler. All right, all right Dan, do you want to pass down the uh, character sheets, please? Sure. Alyssa, what's, uh, what's, your, what's your backstory? Well, I'm... Uh, hi. I'm, uh... You can figure this out, right? It's a pile of folders. Unfortunately, my background isn't as cool as everyone else's. You know, but, Whose uh, background tonight has been cool? Uh, <laughs> Dave fucking most, Klein. Most of, yeah, Dave. I, like, I can't even compare to that. I was born and raised in the valley, so. <laughs> well, but okay. So, 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 you're are you a regular here? Or is this your first show? Oh no, I, I've been here a couple times actually. You know, I sat, I sit in the corner. Do you li- do you listen all the time? Uh, you mean online? Because I'm <laughs> yes. I'm kind of cheap. I I don't. You're from the valley. What city? Uh, North Hills. Yeah. What high school did you go to? James Monroe High School. James Monroe. Monroe, yeah. Monroe. Yeah. Was it? Was it? Was it, was it skeevy? Kind of, yeah. Really? It was pretty nasty. Really? You know, Monroe was, hit was, women. It, <laughs> was that LA Unified or is that a different thing? It's Valley. Yeah. Yeah. It's a, it's yeah. A, so yeah, anybody from the uh, LA area knows of LA USD. It's kind of like. Eh. Oh, I don't know. I don't yeah. know anything about that. I was uh, kids yeah, come okay, up. They sucks. talk about their school. And they go like, "I'm from what? 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 And I go like, "Oh, cool." <laughs> Most people who've actually lived in the valley have never heard of Monroe. They know of the other schools around there, but never Monroe because oh, cool. we're a Baylor school. <laughs> yeah. uh, what, what are your so you're a college student? What's your what's your ambition? What's your interest? Am I a college student? No, or are I'm, you, or, wait, I'm not. Are you in high school? <laughs> no, <laughs> I dropped out of college twice. <laughs> wait, what, uh, I got confused. Wait, wait, what, what, oh, because he, he asked you what school? school you went to. Yeah, that's okay. school. High what, school. What do you? What do you? What's your? Do you have a? Do you have a like a light that you're headed towards? <laughs> I hope not. Is she dying? <laughs> that would be terrible, I think. I'm kind of young. An ambition, a, like, you know, a fantasy, uh, a, well, a job. Uh, well, I do have a job. I've been working at uh, Universal Studios Hollywood for the past four years as a ride operator. A oh, ride yeah? operator? Yeah. Which ride? I, I, I used to work there. Where, where, where are you working? I used to work at Jurassic Park River Adventure, Despicable Me, Minion Mayhem, The Mummy Ride, and um, Super Silly Fun, though. Oh, yeah. I, I, for, I, I spent the summer dressed up as Harry from Harry and the Hendersons in a Sasquatch suit. <laughs> Fucking the I want to ask you shittiest job the about the Jurassic home. Park ride, but I think you'll get fired because it'll it'll come back to you. So it was before you said it's a, the best place to work. At. There's an urban myth about the ride, about the T Rex malfunctioning and spraying searing hot hydraulic fluid that, onto the people. That is actually true, and it doesn't. They don't do that anymore. Now it's just pressurized. Oh, now they, they just roar at you. Now they just roar like, at you. Okay, okay, yeah. Now it's just now it's okay. Now nothing gets sprayed right. at you. Yeah. Chris, Chris Pratt came in and trained the T Rex. <laughs> Okay. Like touched his nose and was just like, "Be still." When that when that now ride it doesn't really move. Anymore. I was working at Universal when that ride first opened, the Jurassic Park ride. Uh, well, just I think just after it opened, and they wanted to put walk around characters in there, and so they wanted like like for the Back to the Future, they had like a Doc Brown, and he would run around and do stuff. And I was part he's of. He's actually walk- still there. It, 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 it might be the same well, guy. Well, no, he's uh, the actual original guy. Died like a couple years ago. Oh, so. Yeah. I'm almost certain I shared a break room with him. Uh, yeah, he so, was a sweetheart though. But I uh, they, there was a, I I went and auditioned. They they t- they thought about having uh, who's the, the doctor the uh, Attenborough from. Ha- Hammond. Ha- uh, Dr. Hammond. Hammond. Yeah. Hammond. John Hammond. Uh, John Hammond. Yeah. Uh, him and a Malcolm, uh, like a Goldblum character, and and I went to the hand prop lot. And I got a leather jacket, and I, I rehearsed and learned in a Jeff Goldblum impression, and went to the hand prop lot, which is this enormous building down in the like in the back lot. Yeah. 
And I walked in and I said, do you have Jeff Goldblum's glasses from Jurassic Park? And they go, uh, yeah, we have the clear ones and the sunglasses. I go, okay, where are they? I, I was just, I just walked in. No one knew who I was. And they got, he goes, it's right here. He opened the case. He walked away. I just went, boink, and took him. <laughs> so so on, my, on my table, I still have the actual glasses that, that Goldblum wore. Because I'm a bad person. That is the, you know, I, I talked about women's rights at one point, and you guys were pretty docile. But stealing, uh, no. Yeah, I, I'm so, I, I, I keep them up on my desk. I, I look at them once in a while and go, those are fucking Dr. Malcolm's glasses, man. <laughs> you guys. Oh, they, they had his prescriptions in there, so I had them popped out, took them to a lens place, and had them put just regular sunglasses in. <laughs> Uh, God damn it! I don't want to derail. What's with now? What? No, okay, we should we should start. But what? the fucking oh, yeah. Jurassic World trailer came out, and, and uh, yeah, it was like like I, I uh, like I don't know. It's a, like like I don't know. There's somebody, <laughs> sort of like informed like uh, nerds kind of hating on it. Like it's like, like it's like oh, it's going to be bad, but I don't really see any evidence. I mean, what the fuck do you want from a? <laughs> I wanted that Jurassic girl not world. to it's have a, a history part... with the guy. Uh, you you know, what? the girl she had a history with Chris Pratt that they revealed. That's dumb. That's too dot connecty to me. I, yeah, well, well I, I mean, that's in the trailer? What, what is she... It was in the thing I saw. I yeah, don't they know. released like an extra, like a, a two-minute scene. With oh, was that not the trailer? Oh, that makes okay. more sense if I think it's it not a trailer. Briefly in the trailer. <laughs> well, Sam Neill really has a backstory of his like, hatred of children. I mean, like, I don't know. Like, Jurassic Park was a pretty satisfying popcorn movie and... You know, like like in the Michael Crichton tradition of theme parks that seem like great ideas that then go wrong, and what what that brings out of people. Like we've had a couple of Jurassic Park sequels that are kind of like off the mark, given that that that's what really hits the spot is like, hey, it's a park, and then the dinosaurs, and then it goes wrong. And it's like the first movie is like the park's not open yet. Now the fucking park's open. Seems like a good sequel. Like yeah, I, I, I I love the premise, I really do. But I think I, I don't mean, I don't I don't like yeah. him like being a raptor whisperer. I think right. that's I don't I don't think you need that. Or but, like, I like the idea of like the park is open there's a, there's a couple thousand visitors and now disaster things happen again yeah it's kind of a nice like parallel to the first one and then but yeah. in a bigger scale which yeah. is what sequels I mean, it's a be. disaster movie just make it it's like uh, Irwin yeah, Allen if, if it's just Blazing make, Inferno if, if they made a bigger Inferno. crazier Sea World Jurassic Park I'd be totally fine with that it's a, there, was, there was a whole like it was decades where it was like we just like to go to the movies and watch like yeah. like 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 man's ambition just go to shit you know it's like <laughs> it's just fun and there's a couple characters in there that get out there's like, you know you introduce each character character like i'm the son of an opera singer and i so <laughs> yeah it's like you get really specific you find these characters and then it's like you you kind of get to pick your own you know favorite you're like i hope that that guy dies uh and, uh, get picked off one by one and then one guy walks away from the whole fucking thing falling apart and goes like the park is closed <laughs> All right. I think that's the movie. Spencer, uh, catch us and scoot up on the events of last uh, last time. <laughs> I'm sorry. One more thing. <laughs> Frank Sinatra. If, in, 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 for, for, this is for this is for Los Angeles people. If anyone that's been to Universal City Walk, like, do you yeah. do you get high off the shot of the pterodactyls plucking people off and like, so like because it just looks like the City Walk and it just like I've I've been on that City Walk and I just want like flying lizards to come and just <laughs> grab. Random people. All right. <laughs>